enough now. Oh, perfect ending. Oh, it's just so tender. Defender. What? Oh, uh, Tender Defender from Fortnite. Oh, oh God, I love that game. Oh, and let me see. Do I have every right to say this? Should be in the contract. Yep, looks like I have every right. Anyways, uh, uh, for those of you who are, you know, watching the video right now, maybe showing it to the whole class, I don't know, okay? Uh, if you're gonna sit here and say, oh, why are they talking about video games? Why are they put such sense of humor in their videos? We're doing this not to make you fall asleep in your chair, because uh, you, we want to make you interested to make you watch two 14-year-old twin boys named Casey and Seth make a fun documentary slash news slash video for you. Okay? And yes, you might see a couple of Fortnite Funko Pops in here, but uh, you know what? That That's a fun game, so if you're going to complain about games, don't! Rampoo, oh, why are you yelling? Oh, I'm so I'm sorry. so sick and tired of you yelling, Rampoo. Some people get so offended today. You know how many people get offended today? What? Oh my god, that's so sexy. Yeah. I'm You're still cleaning up your room after oh. this documentary. <laughs> All right, so uh, get started on uh, broadcasting. Uh, continue. Oh, yeah, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Get the script. All right, <clears throat> today we're going to be talking about hurricanes. For those of you who are not familiar with this type of storm, you're so brave, Dan. All right, so a hurricane is a type of storm, sometimes referred to as a tropical cyclone. Mm -mm -mm, a tropical cyclone. That's quite an outline there. Hey. And it usually forms over warm waters, which you can see right here. And when a storm's maximum winds reach 75, 75, <coughs> excuse me, 75 miles per hour, it is indeed a hurricane, which it is going 75 miles per hour. Perfect. And here are a few tips to stay safe inside your home during a hurricane. Crack shot. Thanks, Rampu. All right, so here's the first tip you want to do during a hurricane. Stay inside and away from windows, skylights, if you have a skylight in your house, and glass doors, like this one here. You gotta close it, and you have to stay away from it at all times, and you need, uh, you gotta uh, use the blinds. You can close those if you want, and do the same thing to windows. Now on to the next tip. So for the second tip you want to take during a hurricane is to find a safe area in your home. For example, a closet or your bathroom on the lowest level of your house. Like, like this right now. I'm, I'm in the bathroom, but you know, the curtains is in a very safe place. But since uh, we're in the making and our mom and dad and our big brother are asleep and our closet doesn't work at the moment, we're going to use the curtains for now. And another very important tip for when you're in your shelter. If flooding threatens your home, turn off all electricity at the main breaker. And a few things you want to keep in hand are batteries, bottled water, and canned food. These things will help you stay alive during the hurricane. And another very, very important tip is to bring your animals inside or find a safe place for them. Like this cat right here, Mr. Ragnall, Tweety, Noodles. He's cornered right now because, you know, he doesn't like cameras being shown in his face and <laughs> this is the only corner he has. It keeps growling and hissing. Anyways, back to you, Rampoo. 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 Rampoo! Ah! Oh, oh, I, I'm terribly sorry, Get Crackshot. Uh, yeah, yes, sir, yes, sir. <gasps> the script! Forgot about the script. Oh, shoot. Oh. That's for next lesson. Oh. Oh, we'll use... That's a week old. Just a love letter. Ah, oh, we can save the binder for later. Puff it. Off you go. There we go. All right. Perfect. All right. So... Be careful. Let's, so, Be careful. So, ha ah! ah! Thank you. Oh, okay. 
Oh my. No worries. It was just it was just a glass. Uh, he dropped a glass bottle. A frappuccino, I think. Anyways, today we're going to uh, bring you three uh, shelters when you're uh, during a hurricane. When when you're in a hurricane during the time. Uh, these are just three because we're not gonna list like four, or five, or you know six. It just can't happen. It just can't. Because you're gonna get bored. All right, here we go. First one we have is Pensacola Bay Center on 201 East Gregory Street in Florida, in Pensacola, Florida. And for two, we have Fasano Shelter on 11-6-611 Denton Avenue, Hudson, Florida. And for the third one, we have Husford School. Serious? What? What, why would anybody go into school for shelter? That's ridiculous! At 1684 Northeast State Route 65, Hudsford, Florida. Ah, uh, that, that's, that's all we have for the three examples of hurricane shelters. And next, after this commercial break, we bring you How Hurricanes Fall. God. Ugh. When that camera flashes right, I need to get my act together. Whew. Oh boy. All right. Thank you, Bright Palma. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So, in today's lesson, you learned about hurricanes, which this lesson was a news broadcast. We don't know what the next lesson is going to be themed on, but God knows what. We'll be creative. We'll think of something. Anyways. Uh, th these uh, last two short lessons on hurricanes are very quick, so don't sit in your uh, seat and go, Oh, he's going to be explaining more even now. I just saw a car with a football stuck under it, dragging it across the street. What? 
whatever. Oh, okay. All right. So don't sit in your seat and go, oh, another lesson. Oh my God. No, you're gonna sit. You're gonna sit up straight, like a like a proper man does, a proper human or whatever you call it. Uh, I'm a hand, so I don't know much about humans. Sit up straight and act like you're interested. And your teachers are especially going to give that info to you. Trust me, they will not allow it. All right. Uh, so, first part we're going to be learning about is damage from hurricanes. So you know that hurricanes are deadly, dangerous storms that can cause billions of dollars in damage. And hurricanes can cause damage through, one, high waves. Two, severe floods. Three, strong winds. And four, storm surges. All right, you know from the damages from hurricanes and what happens after a hurricane. All right, so what you're gonna need to do is one, you're gonna need to, you're going to need to stay indoors until it's safe. Two, you need to check for trapped people and animals. Check for trapped people and animals is very, very important. It's actually important than all the other parts of this lesson. It's very important. So don't sit there and say, oh, my cat's stuck. Oh, I'm not going to give a crap. No, you, you have a heart. Have a heart. Jesus. All right. And three, watch out for flooding. You always need to watch out for that, especially when you uh, come back up from your house and open the basement door. If your house is, if the basement's in your house, yeah, you're going to open it and a bunch of water's going to come out. So be prepared. All right, so that concludes today's lesson. And for the next lesson, we're going to be learning about tornadoes. Stay tuned.